The German wing's co-pilot, suspected of deliberately crashing a plane into the Alps, practiced the fatal descent on an earlier flight. The findings come from French investigators who said Lubitz reduced altitude on a flight from Dusseldorf to Barcelona several times. The director of the investigation explains that when he was alone, the co-pilot set the altitude dial to descend to 100 feet, meaning he practiced the rapid descent he used on the later flight. The captain was unaware because the actions of the co-pilot during the first flight occurred during a programmed descent, which had no impact on the plane's trajectory. Lubitz is suspected of deliberately crashing the jet into the Alps on March 24th, killing all 150 people on board after apparently locking the captain out of the cockpit. Following the crash, German investigators discovered that Lubitz had been signed off sick from work that day and a computer in his home showed he had researched suicide methods in the days leading up to the incident. The French Accident Investigation Agency is due to issue a final report in a year's time, which may include recommendations on cockpit doors and the handling of pilots' medical records. The German wing's co-pilot, suspected of deliberately crashing a plane into the Alps, practiced the fatal descent on an earlier flight. The findings come from French investigators who said Lubitz reduced altitude on a flight from Dusseldorf to Barcelona several times. The director of the investigation explains that when he was alone, the co-pilot set the altitude dial to descend to 100 feet, meaning he practiced